What's up everyone? This is me Sean and today I am here with a story time video for your faces. So yeah, a couple days ago I decided to put a toll a toll a poll out on Twitter and the poll basically asked you guys if you wanted to see a story time series from me and the answer was overwhelmingly yes, you do want to see that. So I'm going to be starting that off today. So let's get right into it. So while I'm telling the story, I am going to be playing the Grinch Simulator, which I thought sounded pretty fun and, uh, and uh, pretty funny as well, so let's go ahead and let's get into that. And yeah, so the story I'm going to tell you guys today is going to be about the time where I broke my two front teeth. So the story takes place about 10 years ago, something like that, and me and my little sister were playing out in the front yard. We were just, you know, sitting out there just having a good time until I did something. I'm not exactly sure what I did anymore, but uh, I did something. And she started to cry. So I was like, well, darn, my mom's gonna come out and she's gonna yell at me because I made my little sister cry. So I should probably find a way to cheer her up. And for some reason, six-year-old me decided to go ahead and lay on my stomach on my skateboard and try to ride into the garage where she was and just do some funny things on the skateboard, I guess. Because I thought laying down on my skateboard on my stomach would be funny. Because I am smart. But, yeah. The thing is, there is a lip between my garage and my driveway where the two different cements, you know, were laid or poured or whatever. So, I get on my skateboard and I try running up into the garage on the skateboard on my stomach. And, you know, when I got to that lip, my skateboard sort of stopped, and I kept going. So, instead of, you know, me riding in the garage on my skateboard, I rode into the garage on my face, more like it. So, yeah, basically what had happened is I flew off the front, slammed my face on the garage floor, I skidded like a foot maybe, and I was, I was a little devastated by it. Luckily, my head did not split open. But what did happen is my two front teeth were each broken in half. So if you can imagine, you know, someone's like a little kid's two front teeth. Just imagine that. But like in half diagonally. It wasn't like it was like straight up in half. It was diagonally. So it was it was pretty bad. It's pretty bad. And uh, I had also earlier that year lost those two baby teeth. So at that point, I had broken the two adult teeth that were in there, and not the two baby teeth. Yeah, I had I had little fangs for a couple of years. <laughs> yeah, it was it was pretty bad. I ended up getting it fixed like two years later because I had a fear of the dentist like no other <laughs> after that. So, um, that was that was a little interesting. But I have a story with the dentist for another time if you guys do so. Um. You so choose, I guess. <laughs> so, yeah, I have not stolen any presents. I am the worst Grinch ever. I'm, I've just been running around this whole time. Goodness. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. Where are all the presents? There are 27 gifts left. There, none have been stolen. Wow. All right, guys. So that concludes the story. I'm going to play one more round of this Grinch simulator because I feel like I want to do at least one thing inside this game before I finish the episode off. Oh, I, I am the Red Grinch. <laughs> Hear my cry. I look absolutely ugly in this in this Red Grinch suit. Present. Stolen. <sighs> did I get it? I did it. I did it. <laughs> yes. Okay, great. Out the door. All right. So... What other presents are there to be stolen today? I need to figure out where they are. There's one right there. Very nice. And that door doesn't open. Amazing. Five gifts... Uh, five gifts have been stolen by me, the Grinch. The best red Grinch that there has ever been. Ever. <laughs> oh, wait, I can't get in there. Why can't I get in there? That other person can. Is there like a secret way in? There is. Through the window. Through the wall. Oh, there's two on the roof. Look at that. That's what I get for looking. That's what I get for trying. Yay. Oh, two more. Oh, joy. There's a lot of presents to be stolen today. Okay, is that it? I think that's it for this house. Moving on to the next one. If I come over here, is there going to be a window or something? Please be a window. Yes, there is a window with some parkour. 
Hotpa! I'm in! Time to find some presents to steal! Okay. I don't see any presents. I think someone might have been in here and stolen all the presents already. Oh, no! I am correct. I've been corrected by myself. Amazing! D get it! Okay, there we go. Uh, any more? I don't see any more. Okay, drop down. Uh, I do not know where I should get any more presents. Why aren't there any more presents in here? I need more presents. Okay. Get on this guy. Maybe there's a present up here? Nope. Okay, well, I'm out. Peace! Okay, so I have stolen 11 gifts instead of the zero of last game, so that's, it's great. That's great. So, what other houses can I break into and steal stuff? Like gifts from... Uh, have I already been over here? I feel like I've been over here before. Or all, all these are just copy-pasted. These are all copy-pasted buildings, guys. Goodness, alright. These are all really easy to get into. This one is exactly like the other. No gifts here. Yet. Uh, maybe if I go on the roof? Maybe? I do not see any gifts on the roof. Alright, roof, please! Give me gifts. Give me life. Don't ever remind me of that game ever again. Ooh, there's a chimney! And there's nothing outside the chimney. No cookies, no nothing? For old Grinchy Santa Claus? Why? They didn't set out any cookies for me. I feel so sad now. I am sad, Grinch. <laughs> Alright, four, three, two, one, zero. Game over! I got fifth place. So, whoa. 48, 30, and 22. Jeez. Those guys are like the best at this game, apparently. Wow. So I'm going to go ahead, I'm going to leave this video here, guys. So I hope you guys did enjoy the very first Storytime video. If you did, likes, favorites, and whatnot are appreciated. Also, make sure to go down in the straw poll below to vote on what I should talk about in my next Storytime video. So, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.